Good evening or good morning or good afternoon. From many part of the world, this is Tony HP and thank you so much for being here today. And I'm doing this quick video uh, in terms of an update as it relates to the survey that I've been distributing for more than a month called the Autism Asperger's Success Survey. First things first, I want to thank you all so much for everybody that have participated in this survey directly and indirectly whether you know people have shared this survey or participating themselves in this survey i'm very grateful for everybody in, from all over the world that have done this survey i truly deeply appreciate your help in finding a solution towards helping our people especially the adults in the autism spectrum to have a much better life with a specific program that i'm working on right now and what i noticed um you know, recently that, you know, I've been hearing feedback in terms of the survey and I have realized that there have been some confusion in terms of the way that the questions are being, you know, the questions were structured. And I was able to review the survey more carefully and I noticed that in the questions, uh, people were having difficulty as to where that this question was related to them or was to relate to another person. Because the questions that I put in the survey were indicating as to, you know, whether a family or relative doing the survey or somebody, you know, someone in the autism spectrum to do the survey. So it was kind of confusing, you know, the questions that some of the questions that I wrote on the survey. And because of that, because of those, uh, you know, that feedback, I was able to make a new update to my survey. So that way, it can better facil facilitate uh, the people that are doing the, you know, that I want to do the survey, which are specifically the people that are diagnosed in the autism spectrum, and also the family members of loved ones, kids, and especially adults in the autism spectrum. So, I was, I was, uh, to, you know, tonight I was able to. Uh, be able to make a couple of fixes in the survey and and what I did was I was able to update and modify the survey and I have no other choice but to split it into two surveys now uh, this is a much better this for me will be a much better way for not only people in the you know family you know, in the autism spectrum to do the survey but very important for family members of people in the autism spectrum to do the survey. So what I did is I was able to do, to be able to split my survey into two. One survey will go directly to the people that are diagnosed in the autism spectrum. And the other survey, it is geared towards the family members, the relatives of, people, of the people that are diagnosed in the autism spectrum. So on this video, I'm going to put the links right down below for the two surveys. One for the, for the people that are in the autism spectrum and the other survey for the family members, the relatives of the people that are diagnosed in the autism spectrum. For me, this will be a much better way to identify the challenges that people in the autism spectrum are currently facing from both point of views, from the parent, from the family members, from the parents and other family members, and also from the people that are in the autism spectrum. I think this will be fair for me to be able to know what are the challenges that, you know, you know the people in the autism spectrum, not only them, but also families are currently facing right now, and work in finding an effective and efficient solution to be able to provide a program to be able to help them lead better lives, especially the autistic adults, which right now the number of the the number of options that are available to help adults in the autism spectrum is very, very low. So as I said, this is just one step towards uh, the project that I'm working on. And but I would as I said, I, I said it before, I'm saying it again, I need as much support as possible to really know what's really going on. What are the challenges that people in the autism spectrum are facing and what are the possible solutions towards helping the people in the autism spectrum, especially adults, 
to achieve greater goals, but most important of all, achieve a greater life. So please, share these links with everybody that you know. Whether you know people in the autism spectrum, share this link with them. It will be great, great help for them to participate in the survey. If you know family members, if you know uh, relatives, not only you know relatives, but you know even friends, friends that you know of that have a relative, you know have a, a person in their families that is diagnosed in the autism spectrum, and you know we will be grateful for them to do the survey too. Well, we need we need to spread the word for these surveys as to as many people as possible. As I said, uh, and, you know, at the beginning of the video, I'm very thankful for everybody who has participated in the survey. You know, for everybody from all over the world, your responses has been truly amazing. You know, very, very grateful for all your support, for your help, because it's not about, you know, this is about you guys. This is about you, helping you, helping the people in the autism spectrum to find a way, one way or the other, to help them achieve a much better and greater life. So I'm going to put the links right down below this video. One link is for is the survey for the people in the, in the autism spectrum. And the other link is the link to the survey for the family members, relatives of people that, have, that are in the autism spectrum. I'll repeat it again, just to be clear. The first link is geared towards people, especially adults, that are diagnosed and are in the autism spectrum. And the second link, the survey and the second link is the survey directed to family members, relatives of people in the autism spectrum. So please share this message with everybody that you know and to spread the word so that way the more people that participate in the survey, the more people in, our, in the autism spectrum, not only them, but also families, participate in the survey the greater the chance we were able to finally create a program to really help our families in order to help their loved ones to have and live a greater life that they truly deserve. Do not let the autism Asperger's and the, the autism spectrum to be a negative, but to be able to overcome the challenges and to really help them to become more part and be, be able to make a significant difference in people's lives. So anyway, I want to do this survey, this uh, update of my surveys. I'm going to put the links below. I'm also going to put the links on my Facebook and we we'll go from there. You know, if any, of you, every, if any of you have any questions or if any other improvements need to be made, I'm, I'm a very open person. I'm always open uh, for suggestions and, you know, I'm very, I expect to, to hear from you guys. So anyway, if you have any questions, please feel free to let me know. So thank you so much. Thank you all for your support. And I'll see you till next time. And until then, this is Tony HP. And everybody have a good night. And God bless. Bye-bye.